Hello friends, hope you're doing great. Um, this is just a quick video um, for all of you Ugandans or people who are employed in Uganda um, and you want to claim your NSSF benefits. Uh, the new update of the NSSF app allows you to do that. Um, this goes to those who are expatriates in Uganda and you're relocating to your own country, I mean your home country, or maybe you are an elderly person and you want to claim for your benefits so um this is how you're going to do it just go to the play store and search for nssf nssf and select nssf go up and then install this app here this one on top i have already installed it and um once you open it, uh, it will ask you to sign in, and you have to sign in using either your email, the email that you use for signing up your NSSF, or your telephone number. It will send you a code which you will use as a password for logging into the app. And after you've done that, um, it will take you through this whole process. I've already set up mine, so I'm just going to log in using my fingerprint. Um, okay. So as it is logging in, um, so here is the screen. Um, I will not fear to display what's on my screen. I will only hide away my email and my telephone number. So um, when you tap on apply for benefits, uh, it will show you all the information about your account and all that kind of stuff. So. Um, if you are someone who is above a certain age, you just tap on edge benefit and then um, it will take you through the whole process. But as for me, I'm 31 years old, so it won't allow me to apply for age benefit. I could also apply for withdrawal benefit. That is for people who are between the age of 50 and 54. Um, yes, and then um, if you are exempted from employment, maybe let's say your employer has maybe terminated your job or something of the kind and maybe you can't get any other job and you're sure you'll never get any other job or maybe you're self-employed you could apply for this uh, and then uh, this goes to now for those who are okay if you get into um, an accident and you're unable to work anymore you could choose invalidity benefit um, then uh, for those who are moving out of the country uh, let's say you are a ugandan um you're going to choose you're going to choose um you i'm uh, okay you are a ugandan you're going to choose the payment method you want of course it will be bank this way and then um you're going to attach your letter of uh of termination of contract and that will work for you and after you there are so many letters you can easily attach here there's a lot of documentation required your residence card uh, you're going to anything that is required you'll attach it there um, if you are maybe in a non-ugandan and your contract has ended and you want to move out of the country you could still uh, choose non-ugandan then you have to select your employer introduction letter attach it there foreign citizenship letter attach it there evidence everything that is required you'll just scroll through you see whatever is required attach it then after that you go through all the steps that are required and you will be able to um, claim your benefits from nssf right now we are not yet sure how long it takes but in case uh you need to find out more you you can call nssf and they will be able to help you out thank you very much for watching this video have a great time everyone